when you describe all of that abuse, um, what specifically does that mean? Because I think sexual abuse, you know, I, I don't know if that's something you've experienced or not. It's up to you, how, whatever you want to share about your own experience. I did, I did experience sexual. I did experience okay. sexual abuse already in kindergarten by the by the Hasidic uh, teacher himself. Okay, that's this a lot. Was, this, was, this was in London, England. Yeah, I came. I came to to Canada the first time at the age of ten, and the second time at the age of uh, thirteen. And do you feel like that is normalized in that world? Or is this just something, because I'm certain the counter argument there being, so there's, you know, bad people in every group and, you know, this wasn't. Uh, no, something... no, it's not, it's not, it's not like in every group for, for different reasons. So for example, uh, so it's similar to, I would say to the Catholic church uh, um, uh, uh, controversies about sexual abuse. I think in many cases, in many, in many ways, it's similar. So, mm. so for example, the the silencing that you could not go to the you should not go to the police and you could not go to the authorities, uh, and you always take the side. The community always take the has to always take the side of the abusers and the side of the system and the leadership and the principles and the and not the side of the victims and you shun the victims. Uh, that's one thing. And the second thing is that in a regular in a regular society, uh, people are not so uh, sex craved, sex desperate, sexual des desperation that they feel that they need to uh, to do sex with children. Okay, uh, uh, but in the Hasidic system, with for the same reason as in the Catholic Church. You do have this 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 idea. That's number two. Number three, in a regular society, in a regular system, many people, even if they would like to to have sexual relations with children, they wouldn't do it because they are aware that they they are afraid of the authorities, or they are aware of how much it harms the children. And since they are good people in their hearts, they would. The, the, they would be afraid to harm children, right? But in the Hasidic system, I can say about myself, um, we never heard even the term of rape. Uh, we never heard the term of maybe rape. We heard in 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 a different language, like maybe in in biblical language, but we never heard the term of um, sexual abuse or pedophilia. We never we never heard the term. Uh, and we never, we were never told that there's a difference between having sexual relations with a 10 year old child or having sexual relations with a 15 year old child or having sexual relations with a 35 year old. We were never told there is a difference. The only thing we were told is that sex with anyone who is not your partner, not your wife or your husband is forbidden, is taboo. But we were never told that there are differences between sex with children or sex with adults. So that's why whenever uh, Hasidim decide they, they do want to sin, many times they're not even aware that when they do it with children, it's different than when, when they would commit the sin with 20-year-olds, 30-year-olds. 